So today I'm here at Jones for some Halloween animatronics and light up decorations. Because word on the streets is they got a lot. So we're going to see what they got. Hey look it's Best Buy. Everybody remember Best Buy? So we're going to hit the hay with Jones. Hey look they got some hay. How convenient. So let's go inside and see what they got. Oh look, they got some surfboards to start. Some Halloween surfboards, that's pretty cool. One's got a light in the middle. So this would be cool to hang up on your front door. And looks like they got some Raggedy Ann scarecrows. One's just having a coffee relaxing. Hey, and look, it's Bruce. Hey Bruce, how you doing buddy? So that's actually pretty cool. I like how the eyes light up and the jaw moves. Pretty tall, about maybe eight foot. Bruce is a former employee. You got anything else to say, Bruce? Talk to me, buddy. Please come in and stay a while. Watch out for my spider collection. I let them out for a little That's actually pretty cool. I like how his eyes light up. He's got the jibba jaw. Do wish the body moved a little bit though. But that's nice. Bruce came to the door to greet me. I guess he knew he was coming. No, I was coming. He don't know if he's coming or going. He's a skeleton. And we got a lot of Halloween socks. If anyone wants some pumpkins on their feet. Oh, looks like we got another animatronic. A pumpkin head. Scarecrow. It's Marvin. <laughs> It looks like Marvin's in the Halloween. He rocks back and forth a little bit. Alright, so let's see if Marvin says anything else. Let's go back a little bit. And we go forth a little bit. Talk to me, Marvin. What's up? I sure am. Lucky for me, I have this smile carved on my face. Alright, so Marvin's rocking back and forth. He's got the pumpkin head. He's a scarecrow. So as you can see, the animatronics here compared to Lowe's are a little more kid-friendly. So look at all the stuff they have here for Halloween. All the different decorations and light-ups. So let's dig into it a little bit. Start off with the welcome mats, the beware, the boo. Actually, I hear something behind me, guys. What is this? Wow, that's actually pretty cool. Some animatronic brooms. What are those from Cinderella? That's actually pretty cool. I like it. And we got some Halloween string lights. Let's see how these light up. Wow, the skulls actually look pretty cool. Decent. Got some witches. And we got some pumpkins. Oh, those light up nice and bright. So as you can see, it says $20, but most of the stuff is like 40% off or 50% off. So it's kind of like, you know, I wouldn't pay 20, but I'd pay 10. So they're just pretending there's an incredible sale. We got some boo light up signs. I don't know if you guys can really see that. But again, if it was dark and scary and spooky in the store, a lot of the stuff would probably light up and pop. What do we got over here? We got an orange pumpkin head skeleton. Wow, look at all the skeletons though they have here. You want skeletons, you come to Jones. So these actually talk. Talk to me, pumpkin head, talk to me. Pumpkin lights up. Nice. It's actually pretty cool. You don't see too many yellow, orange, pumpkin head skeletons. That's decent. You see the white skeleton next to him looking at him like, You crazy, pumpkin head. What you talking about, man? So these light up too, I think. Let's see. 
Here we go. Let's push the button and see what this one has to say. It's pretty cool, and I like how the eyes light up. Still jibba jabbing. Nice. So these are decent skeletons. You can hang them on your door, your wall, or maybe your porch. But they got tons and tons of skeletons. Here, let's push this one too. Now he's got a buddy to talk to. I like how the jaws move. It's actually pretty realistic. Ah, see, they're just yapping away, having a good time. So lots of skulls and skull heads and skeletons. That lights up pretty cool red. The eyes pop. And this one's already lit. It's got different colored eyes. That one looks a little crazy though. We got some cocoons. Looks like cocoons from Aliens almost. Love the movie Aliens and Alien. And then we got some tiny hanging skeletons. We got some chicken or rooster skeletons. Huh. And we got some Texas Longhorn oxes or something skeletons. They let up pretty neat on the inside there. And we got some prehistoric mini dinosaur skeletons. I'm down with that. Actually, they look like the creatures from Stranger Things. I think it was season three in the school. And they're chasing the kitties around. We got a snake skeleton. Good variety here. Everything 40% off. Check out the other side of the aisle. Now we got some goth type Halloween signs and mirrors. This is actually a pretty cool hand. Got some artwork. Same with the skull. It's pretty cool. And we got some Boo and Witch Silhouette Halloween decorations. Uh, we got animatronic here, I'm hoping, thinking. Gee, buddy, give me a hand. How you doing? Hanging in there? Let's push the button, see what he says, what he does. Oh, he's all dancing, moving, and grooving. That's actually pretty cool. He's all in it. He's ready for Halloween. Nice. Pretty lively for a skeleton, if you ask me. I like it. And here we go. We got some light up. Remember that uh, cartoon Thundar, I think it was? Thundar the Barbarian, and he had Igloo and something else. There's two little ghost things that's what those look like remind me of that was a cool cartoon too and we got some light up skulls or pumpkins maybe maybe these ones don't light up all right this one lights up bird on top of the silver skulls silver skulls look kind of neat Let's see how this lights up Lights up inside. Again, if it was dark, spooky, scary, these would probably pop more. Same with this one, I'm assuming. It's got some Halloween string lights on the witch's hat. Uh, that's a little clever. You could probably put your Halloween bowl with candy on there for the kitties. Got some black pumpkins. Let's see how those light up. I uh, actually let up orange in the inside. That's pretty cool. Good contrast. Now we got some more skull heads. Because remember, Jones is known for skulls. Kind of surprised I got all this scary stuff here for the kitties. That's pretty cool. He's on a stack of books. Remember, reading is fundamental. Skulls reminding you. That's good. Educational. It's a pretty cool bat, mug type light up skull. 
bat skull, I guess you would say. Oh, and how romantic, they're on the boat. Just pat on a little bit. And the lantern lights up, that's kind of neat. Looks like they're in love, that's cute. Oh, and these look cool, these haunted houses. Do these light up? No, yes. Wow, these look pretty cool. They should light up, make them nice and creepy. You gotta light up, guys. What's going on over here? I like the black on orange. Alright, so it's one of the pull tabs and the switches. I don't want to run the batteries for anybody, but those look kind of neat. And we got a little red baron, like the old Hot Wheels car. Big skull head popping out with his little skull buddies. Lights up pretty good. We got a classic typewriter. Must have been typing a long time if he's got a skull hand, huh? Got the Wicked Witch's boots. And we got some birds that are missing arms or something. I don't know what's going on with this. Someone get hungry? Looks like they don't light up though. So we got a lot of different pumpkins. How many light ups did we count so far? Like 25, 50? Really surprised and pretty cool how many different light ups they have. So I'm enjoying doing these Halloween uh, videos, guys. The first one was the Lowe's, if you haven't seen. Check that out. Now we got Jones. I'm probably going to do. Uh, What's that other one called? It wasn't open yet. Spirit Halloween, when they open up, I might do them. Maybe Home Depot. So give my channel a like and a subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. This is kind of neat. Instead of Cat in the Hat, you got Cat in the Halloween. It actually lights up different colors. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. We got some tiny ghosts. What about Space Ghost, guys? How come I don't have any Space Ghost Halloween decorations? Those would be pretty cool, wouldn't they? They got some pretty cool signs. Oh, they got jokes. Hey, boo. I'm a haunt mess. Clever. This one lights up. This could probably look pretty cool. And do it with one hand. Let's see. Ah, that actually looks pretty cool. I like that. This one light up? I guess not. Still looks pretty cool though. And we got some cats and some hats and some bats. That's a pretty cool one right there with the bats and the Happy Halloween. On tons and tons of bats. Looks like something out of Batman. What about Batman? Can we get some Batman Halloween decorations? That'd be neat too. Check out the side aisles. Slight Halloween fall, although I guess those are gnomes or dwarfs, I don't know. So this is the theme, the place and the time. That's what Jones is calling it, or maybe that's their brand of Halloween decorations. We got some necklaces, sitting Mardi Gras, we got some Halloween necklaces. There's another aisle with some stuff, maybe some Halloween crafts to be painted. Again, 40% off. So we got some more roosters. So now we got some ducks, some duck skeletons, oh, and dog skeletons. Wow. Jones definitely known for the skeletons. I'm surprised since they're mostly uh, supposed to be fabric, fabrics and crafts for kitties and parents. But we're getting some spooky stuff here towards Halloween from Jones. Looks so like we got some figurines. Ah, look at that. He's just taking a bath before Halloween, relaxing. Ah, and just stretching before they go door to door for the candy. Ah, we got some more of the, the lovebirds. 40% off, guys. Get them while they're hot. These are actually pretty cool. Oh, look at that. More in love. These are actually pretty cool detail. You got just relaxing before Halloween, just lounging. 
Wow, and look at that. He just proposed her. How romantic is this? All these romantic Halloween figurines, skulls, couples. Pretty cute. I like it. Oh, look at that rock and roll one with the guitar. That's actually pretty cool. Good detail. Yeah, these look decent. So guys, I think that's about it for my tour of Jones. What'd you, what'd you think? What'd you like? Do you have any favorites? 